This video will show what a T-handle tap wrench is. There's a few main parts to one. This is the body. This is the handle. The grooves over here is how far the handle can slide back and forth. There's a slot on the inside with a hole. And that's to give room for this pin. which connects the two jaws together and this nut will go on top of the assembly there's a taper on the inside as you tighten the nut the taper will cause the jaws to get closer together so that they can clamp down on the tapper. This is a tapper. A tapper is used for threading holes like the holes there on this one, two, three block. This hole, this hole, this hole, this hole, this hole are the ones that are threaded. see that. And then once everything is put together, you just use the tap wrench and the tapper. You just use the tap wrench to drive the tapper into the threaded hole. Tappers come in all different sizes. This is a tap and die set that I bought a while back. It's just a cheap one. This set actually came with a tap wrench of its own. Here's the handle to it slides in and this is the nut this has a different design it's got two slots cut in but only a smaller diameter tapper can fit into it Put this back together. All you have to do is you stick the jaws, you stick the pin into the two holes there in the jaws. Slide it in. Install the nut. And I'll get one of these smaller tappers to stick in. There you have it. You just take it, stick it into the hole that it needs to go into, and turn it with the handle. 